Yes, it is Iowa Live. It is a Friday. Welcome to the program, everybody, on Veterans Day. To all those who have served, thank you for everything that you have done to give us our freedoms that we enjoy today. It is so much appreciated. If you do see a veteran today, make sure you walk up and shake their hand and just look them in the eye and say thank you. But we have a busy show here today, uh, but we're going to be shifting gears just a little bit. We're very excited to talk to Joe Bonamassa, one of the greatest guitar players in the world who's performing here at the Civic Center on Sunday. This is someone you do not want to miss. We had him scheduled to talk to us today. Everything was ready to go, but unfortunately, he's unable to join us here today. But uh, earlier this morning, we received a message from Joe for everybody here in Iowa. Here's Joe. What's up, Iowa? Looking forward to coming back to Des Moines. It's been a long time. Looking forward to seeing you guys at the Des Moines Civic Center, November 13th. It will be a blast of good blues rock for the whole family. Yeah, good blues rock. This guy is absolutely phenomenal. For those people that are into rock music, you know who Joe Bonamassa is. You've seen the billboards all around town. You know the great music he plays. But did you know that he opened for B.B. King when he was 12 years old. And then B.B. King asked him if he wanted to go on tour with him that summer while he was off school, which he did at the age of 12. That's how talented this guy was. Then uh, continues on with his expertise and his uh, guitar virtuoso. Uh, check out, here's a video of him in concert right now to show you what he looks like and, and how he performs. Uh, he's phenomenal on the guitar now, folks. He has had over 20 number one albums on the Billboard Blues album charts. And just incredible. Uh, he sings, he plays. Uh, he is the uh, definition of what a rock guitarist is all about. And he is gonna be here on Sunday at the Des Moines Civic Center. Listen to him. Boy, with such soul. And then look at this guitar work. This is normal for this guy. This is the way Joe Bonamassa plays, and this is what you're going to experience at the Des Moines Civic Center coming up on Sunday if you have an opportunity to go. If you have a chance to go, we highly suggest going. I'm wondering uh, what songs he's going to play from uh, all he's had. I think he has over 40 albums now, uh, so the guy has a lot to choose from. But Time Clocks is uh, the album that he's going to be playing a lot of stuff from. If we can uh, show the, the, the Time Clock stuff here, check this out. Uh, you can get it uh, on CD. You can get it digitally. I, I'm not sure about the vinyl. Believe it or not, I think vinyl uh, was selling so well. You might want to double check on that, but you can download uh, the album Time Clocks and check it out. He'll be playing a bunch of stuff from Time Clocks. But let's show you the uh, uh, something else that he is very involved in. He's involved in a charity called called Keeping the Blues Alive, and uh, very much so into uh, education and keeping uh, music alive in hearts and in souls. He has an organization, a charity organization, that is designed just for that. And they also have another program, part of this, called Fueling Musicians, which actually provides funding to help get musicians back on the road with everything that happened with COVID. That's his way to give back. He even has a, a podcast, and the place place that he hangs out with, he calls it Nerdville. So Joe's podcast is live from Nerdville. He has an incredible collection of guitars and, and stuff in the music industry, and he talks with rock stars of all shapes and sizes, all forms, and blues artists. Of course, you can check out his podcast. Take a look, and here's the details on his concert on Sunday. Uh, it is going to be at the Civic Center, and you can find it. Uh, if we go to the first graphic, please, that'd be great. And the, the Civic Center is where he's going to be performing. You can go and get the information at uh, dmpa.com or also at jbonamassa.com, and it'll link you right there, arguably the biggest blues guitarist. There it is. That's all happening this week. So there you have it. A lot of things going on Sunday at the Civic Center, and uh, one of the best in the business ever, Joe Bonamassa, is going to be here.